guys, my name is Chen Xue. My undergraduate major is art and technology. Uh, now I'm a design director at a medical technology company, and I'm skilled in user experience design and product development. This is my team. We've been working together for almost four years. As the team leader, I led my team to develop excellent products in intelligent medical services. I'm also passionate about digital art, game design, and VR AR. As a person who has a passion for life, I would do sports, scuba diving, and photography. My creative expression comes from my life. I'm good at finding beauty in life, and I'm keen on observing social problems such as neglected vulnerable groups and unbalanced distribution of power. Now I will start answering the questions. Um, how can we make creative fields and discipline more equitable, diverse, and inclusive? Uh, well, first, we should provide equal opportunity for people who come from different backgrounds and classes, such as giving them professional training, workshops, and a lab uh, to develop their talents and support them to be successful in their field. Second, we should create an inclusive environment. As we know, creative fields as a powerful tools with huge cultural potential and impact. So we should use this potential to gain recognition and understanding for underrepresented and vulnerable groups. Um, finally, we should encourage collaboration and multidisciplinary, which can help people to establish a more diverse environment and cultivate their critical thinking because um, they have more opportunity to exchange their ideas and foster their imagination. Okay, next question. Uh, what opportunities and pitfalls arise in making computational technology century to create your practice? Well, um, I'm going to talk about opportunities first. I found the computational technologies enable creativity to be free from physical constraints and provide people with a much larger stage to develop their unlimited creativity. Um, such as new tools and technologies can help people to create extremely advanced software or application like AR, VR, or wearable devices. Mm, about pitfalls. Mm, first, I think computational technology will make people gradually become lazy and lose the ability to think. People can no longer create a unique personal work. Um, the market will become full of the same digital products. And second, um, it's unfair to some people who cannot get an equitable resource or education. Um, then these people will also lose equal competitive opportunities.